and welcome to this guitar review. My name's Casper, I mean Justin Johnson, I mean Casper, and today we're reviewing the Kersey Guitars Sequoia 510. It's a fantastic instrument, I can tell you that already. I picked it up a couple days ago, only for borrows. I can't keep it as much as I want to. On first impression, it was great, but I really wanted this to be the first impression. I tried to film yesterday, I was tired, I tried, I cried, I fell asleep, I woke up, watched a film. Anyway, here it is. It's, it's fantastic. I, the finish on it is lovely. Uh, and that's the first thing I noticed, it was... At first it was like, I was like, oh, it's a gloss, but it's got this kind of matte finish to it. I, I, I don't really know how to put it. I have the specifics, though. Mahogany neck. Ebony fingerboard. Ash body. It's got this lovely veneer on the headstock as well. I think it's a, a piece that Matt's put and then glued on it. I think that's what a veneer is. <laughs> I could go on about what's on this, but to keep it simple, it's it's kind of like a cross between a Fender and a Les Paul. Fender anything. So it's slightly offset, but I, yeah, I, P90 pickups. And the reason why I'm not going to go into huge detail about this is because if you contact Matt at Cozy Guitars, he will just you tell him what you want, and he will make it. And like as far as I know, these this is some of, this is one of the best prices I've seen for a custom guitar. Um, uh, Matt's kind of just starting out. I've known him for a while, and already the quality is insane of what he's doing. So hats off to him. I got to go and visit him uh, at his workshop. And it was really cool. It was on a farm. I'm going to roll some footage on top of here of my journey there and what it was like in there. And everything's made from scratch. So let's get some clean tones, eh? And I'm just going to cycle through the settings and tell you what they are, because that's what we do. Here's the bridge position. <laughs> Here's the neck. And now, in the middle position, there's a secret weapon. The neck pickup switches in and out of phase. So, I'll give you a bit of that. This is the outer phase. So. Let's get some dirt on it in the same order. Oh, it's screeching. It loves it. Neck. some Albert King vibes with the out phase position we're going middle and both 
pickups in phase. <laughs> Fantastic. Matt will build whatever you want. If you want it to fly, if you want to put wheels on it, if you want to have a Floyd Rose, I'm sure he can work that out, but like, I don't know. For me personally, I wouldn't change anything about this one. Give it to me, Matt. Give it to me. Huh? He said that. Uh, yeah, there's loads of details on here, which I love. Like, there's the, at the end of the fretboard, there's sort of like a, it's sort of been sanded down a bit or something where it kind of ramps down into the thing i like the pit guard as well uh what, what i like the most is this is a unique design there's a builder coming out with his own shape like yeah people could say like oh yeah it's sort of les paul i, I wouldn't even like say it's les Pauly. it's i've never seen a shape like it where it doesn't look too out of this world and you know it's vintage but it's retro so what i mean by that is I feel like it's either 50s or it could be 80s. I, I, but you know what? It's 2021. Why don't we get some sounds going? Let's do some Albert King stuff. string but you know what I think I held it off quite well I don't have spares and I have to give the guitar back soon uh, but I played through the pickups I played through the song and I think you all get the idea I was still able to get those Albert King licks but everyone knows they break strings Matt I will PayPal you for a string thanks for watching down below you can find any links to Matt's website and his Instagram where you can contact him about any inquiries. I'm sure he will give you a quote or something. I've been Casper Berry Rapkin, Justin Casper Berry Rapkin, and this has been Cozy Guitars.